Today, I'm going to show you how to get live Databricks data directly into your spreadsheet using Coefficient. Once you've installed Coefficient, launch the extension. Select Import From. Next, you'll want to add a new source. Search for Databricks. Select Connect. To begin, you'll need to locate your JDBC URL from your Databricks instance. So in Databricks, you'll want to navigate to Compute. Scroll down to Advanced Options. Here, you'll see JDBC slash ODBC. Select that. And then here, you'll want to copy all of this and open up a text editor. Paste that and then delete where it says personal access token. Then navigate back to Databricks. Go to your settings. Then under developer, you'll go to manage access tokens. Generate a new token. Copy that. Go back to your text editor and paste. Then you'll want to copy all of this. Go back to your spreadsheet. Paste here in the box provided. And then you'll go to pick your catalog. I'm going to choose samples. And then select connect. Here you'll have an option to share your Databricks connection with your team members. And now you can begin your first import. From here, you can select from tables and columns. This will open the import preview, and here you can select which data you want to import into your spreadsheet. You can select which fields are more meaningful for your use case, and you can drag and drop so that all of the fields are in the order that you want so that they always refresh in the same order. Once you're happy with your configuration, select import. After your data is in your sheet, you can set up an auto refresh schedule to keep your data up to date. Now that you know how to get started, you can begin pulling in your own Databricks data. We hope you try it out for yourself, and thanks for watching.